फ्रेंड्स टूडेज टॉपिक इज हाउ टू रीड ए चेस्ट एक्सरे लेट अस डिस्कस अबाउट इट आई विल गिव ए सिंपलेस्ट वे टू एग्जामिन इट फर्स्ट वी विल डिस्कस व्हाट आर द मेरिट्स इन फेवर ऑफ एक्सरे व्हाई डू एक्सरे नॉट अदर रेडियोलॉजिकल इन्वेस्टिगेशंस द मेरिट्स आर इट इज इजीली अवेलेबल सेकेंड इट इज चीप थर्ड हैविंग क्विक डायग्नोसिस फोर्थ डोंट नीड एक्सपर्ट रेडियोलॉजिस्ट व्हाट आर द डिमेरिट्स इन इट्स फेवर फर्स्ट इट हैज रेडिएशन एक्सपोजर सेकेंड इट प्रोड्यूस ओनली टू डी इमेज दैट्स वाई इमेज ऑफ वन ऑर्गान विल ओवरलैप विद अदर That's why it cannot diagnose many abnormalities, due to which we depend on other radiological investigations like CT scan, MRI. What are the indications of chest X-ray? You can go for chest X-ray in presence of symptoms like chest pain, fever. chronic or persistent cough shortness of breath difficulty in breathing hemoptysis decrease weight these are the symptoms where you can go for chest x ray other indications are hypoxia crepitation wheeze ronchi when these are present on physical examination you can go for chest x ray at last but not the least to check the position of the tubes like rail's tube endotracheal tube chest tube and to check the position of the central line you can go for it now come to the main topic how to read a chest x ray you should remember a mnemonic history rip abcd Again, I am telling you should remember a mnemonic: history, RIP, ABCD. In the section of history, you should ask, "Whose X-ray is this?" That means you are not examining the X-ray of another patient. When it is done, it is done in pre-op period or post-op period, and ask for any previous X-ray present. why it is done for it is done for medical fitness or presence of any symptoms where it is done it is done in icu or radiological department if it is done in icu most commonly it is a fpu if it is done in radiological department most commonly it is a pa view now come to the section r i p r means rotation that means you check the x-ray is rotated or not if it is a rotated x-ray ask for a fresh one i for inspiration check it is a inspiratory film or expiratory film if it is a expiratory film ask for a fresh one p p for penetration or exposure check whether it is under exposed or over exposed if it is under exposed or over exposed ask for a fresh one now come to the section a b c d e a for examination of airway b for breathing c for circulation d for diaphragm and delegates delegates means which is breakable like bone E for extra that is check the position of central line tubes foreign bodies artificial heart valves pacemakers now details about how to read a chest x-ray it should be in a systematic way and step by step form you should remember a mnemonic history rip and abcd again i am telling you should remember a mnemonic history rip abcd 
in the section of history you should ask whose x-ray is this that is make sure that it is of the same person when it is done it is done in pre-operative period or post-operative period and ask for any previous x-ray is present by your side and compare with it why it is done for it is done for getting medical fitness certificate or presence of any symptoms or for any surgery where it is done it is done in icu or in radiology department if it is done in icu most probably it is a anterior posterior view if it is done in radiology department most probably it is a pa view then come to the section r i p r stand for rotation confirm it is not a rotated x-ray if it is a rotated x-ray ask for a fresh one i stand for inspiration confirm it is an inspiratory film if it is a expiratory one ask for a fresh one p stand for penetration or exposure confirm it is a good exposure if it is over or under exposed ask for a fresh one then come to the section a b c d e where a stand for examination of airway b stand for examination of breathing c stand for examination of circulation d stand for examination of diaphragm and delegates delegates means which is breakable that is bone e stand for extra that is check the position of the central line endotracheal tube riles tube chest tube foreign body pacemakers and artificial heart valves again i am telling you should remember the mnemonic history rip and a b c d e in normal x-ray three color appear that are black gray and white again i am telling three colors are appear in normal x-ray that are black gray and white then what is abnormal that means change of color of a specific organ in the other word you can say if an organ originally looks black now it is abnormally black or gray or white in color or vice versa is abnormal remember normally three color appear on x-ray change of color of a specific organ is abnormal how things look on x-ray ar looks black in color fat dark gray in color soft tissue gray in color bone and calcium white in color metal purely white in color again i am telling ar black fat dark gray soft tissue gray bone and calcium white and metal purely white in color now come to the density in x-ray more dense means more whitey side less dense means blacky side again i am telling more dense is towards whitey side less dense is towards blacky side in the other word you can say air has least density and metal has most density that means you can say as you proceed from air to metal density gradually increases and as you proceed from metal to air density gradually decreases due to air have least density 
इट एज मिनिमम टिश्यू एब्जॉर्बसन सो एयर इज रेडियोलुसेंट मेटल हैज मैक्सिमम डेंसिटी सो मेटल हैविंग मैक्सिमल एक्सरे एब्जॉर्बसन सो मेटल इज रेडियो ओपेक रिमेम्बर एयर हैविंग मैक्सिमल एक्सरे ट्रांसमिशन बट मेटल हैविंग मैक्सिमल एक्सरे एब्जॉर्बसन In X-ray, there are two things. One is light source or X-ray beam. Another is X-ray plate to know the lucency and opacity of an organ. That is, which organ is radio transparent or radio lucent, and which organ is radio opaque. The organ which is towards blackish side is radio lucent or radio transparent. and the organ which is towards white side is radio opaque now discuss with an example air is least radio opaque most radio lucent and black in color metal is most radio opaque least radio lucent and white in color In the other word, you can say as you proceed from air to metal, opacity increases but lucency decreases. As you proceed from metal to air, opacity decreases but lucency increases. In the slide, there is an X-ray plate present. Whereas air, which is outside the patient body, that is room air purely black in color air inside the soft tissue that is inside the lung is gray in color water and soft tissue gray in color bone and calcium white in color metal purely white or abnormally white in color if chest contains only lungs it will appear like this on x-ray but actually chest contain different type of organs soft tissue bony material that's why it will appear like this on x-ray so you should be acquainted with normal x-ray then after you are able to detect the abnormal one Now you should see four to five slides of normal X-ray with different tissue impressions. See the cardiac impression and long impression X-ray. Entire lung is divided by three imaginary lines into four parts. There are apical lobe, upper lobe, middle lobe, and lower lobe. See posterior ribs are more or less horizontal but anterior ribs are inclined See the rib impressions and intercostal spaces See the position of trachea and its bifurcation into bronchus as trachea contain air it is towards blacky side see the position of hilum see the position of aortic arch and different tissue impressions see the vascular markings on x-ray you should acquainted with the normal one then you can able to detect the abnormal one when need pause the video and see different tissue impressions on x-ray 
रिमेम्बर हिस्ट्री आर आई पी एंड ए बी सी डी ई थैंक यू थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग